All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have finally wrapped up Red Dead Redemption, which crosses off one of the many games I've had on the old bucket list for the channel, which means we still need to finish Dead Space, and I think I had, like, one more stray project that I kind of wanted to tackle at some point. Sadly, there are a lot of games that I want to record right now, but because I work full-time and, you know, my free time is rather limited, I have to be kind of choosy when it comes to games that I record, and I gotta pick favorites because I just... I don't really want to juggle multiple games at once right now because I don't want to burn myself out. So, today we'll be jumping into Grand Theft Auto 4 as promised. This is the Xbox 360 version of the game because the PC version of this game is kind of a poorly optimized pain in the ass and I just didn't feel like messing around with any of that. I opted for the plug and play version because I'm a fucking chimpanzee when it comes to PC optimization mods. And look, I, I realize it's not that hard, I just don't want to fuck with it. Like, Plus the game costs more money on Steam and I snagged me a physical copy with a, with a poster for like 8 bucks. So call me Mr. Krabs, but that's a pretty damn good deal, SpongeBob. But anyway, I don't I don't need to give this game much of an introduction, do I? GTA GTA 4 is one of the most legendary video games ever made, and I don't say that lightly. When this game came out, it literally sold consoles that people didn't want to buy. Fellas, there there was a time when nobody wanted an Xbox 360 because they were batshit unreliable and they broke all the time. You know, you had like the the red ring of death. It was a big meme. Uh, and nobody wanted a PS3 because they were serious Scrooge McBucks. Like, I'm pretty sure the PS3 was like 700 bucks when it came out and no one could afford it. So when GTA 4 hits the scene, not only is it a sequel to GTA 3, Vice City, San Andreas, you know, some of the most acclaimed video games ever made, but the game just kind of exploded in popularity and all the talk and hype around this game eventually drove tons of people to buy more consoles. That and the fact the consoles finally got cheaper, but you know, real quick, I'm going to take you guys back to a time where I was probably like 12 years old and the one game I wasn't allowed to play was GTA. So at one point I obtained a PlayStation Store gift card and I used that gift card to secretly purchase and download GTA 4 onto my system like the sneaky little bastard I was. And from that point forward, my friends and I were hopelessly addicted to this game, and we played the absolute gosh darn shit out of it. I remember how amazing everything about this game felt back then. Just, you know, the Liberty City open world, and the characters, and the story, which felt like a fucking HBO show. All the random GTA shenanigans that are just always fun. And by this point, I haven't played the game in at least, like, eight years or so, maybe longer. But I do remember an okay bit about how to play it, so hopefully when we jump back in, things won't be too terrible. And without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen, it is with great pleasure that I say to you right now, Nico, cousin, let's go bowling. Alright, let's start a new game. Also, this game does not have a main menu, so here I am doing this from the normal menu. But hey, it's not my fault. I'm sorry. I'm not Rockstar Games. Take your blind rage out on Rockstar for not adding the shit. But alright, I'll shut up for this cutscene. The commentary is probably going to be a little bit limited for, for a while here. Dave's busy. Oh, Dave's coming. He's he's just not coming in the way that you might expect. Oh, yeah? Yes, he's got the law. House, women, cars, parties. Uh, he writes me in these wild emails, and after I got into trouble, I thought maybe, uh, 
then I got this gig and I spent the next seven months with you fine people and they forget. Whoa, what the fuck? It's the secret ingredient. They're smuggling diamonds. Smuggling it in the soup. However the fuck that's supposed to work. Nobody could. So I did some dumb things, got involved with some idiots. Ah, we all do dumb things. That's what makes us human. Could be. Grand Theft Auto is... This is such a dope intro. I totally forgot about this, dude. Like, the music? You know, like, this is, like, really well done. Welcome to Liberty City. It has been a long time since I've played a GTA game that's taking place in Liberty City. Uh oh, I smell my cousin. Roman! The most Italian Russian of all time. Good to see you, man. What? You forget our language? Capusi? Maybe a little. I've been here 10 years. You could speak English. Remember, we learned how the English girls with the big. A little. I'm not so good. You'll be fine. Better than my Serbian. Ah! So good to see you, cousin. I can't believe you made it. Shit. I have to tell you, I had quite a night last night. Two women. The land of opportunity. Ah, I've made it. <laughs> Why was it so exhausting for him to just open the trunk of a car? He was like, oh! Buddy, just take over the world someplace else, yeah, all right? Buddy. You're in the hey, goddamn world. Screw right. you! <laughs> Screw you <laughs> all! On, my man. cousin is here! Nico Bellic! He's the fucking man! Yeah, you guys go take those boxes with credits Come somewhere on, else. Uh, to the mansion, huh? Yes, the mansion! <laughs> <laughs> maybe you should drive. Oh, maybe I should. Okay. Yeah, maybe I should drive. I'm hey, fucking again? foreigner, new to this country. I totally know how these roads work. I know you're drunk, Roman, but I'm not necessarily our best bet here. Maybe we should just get an Uber and call today. Alright, so as I was saying, I'm going to try to keep my commentary to kind of a minimum <clears throat> for these first few minutes here, just because there's going to be a lot of dialogue, and I don't want to interrupt the shit out of... Uh, the story, obviously, so... I'm gonna try not to interrupt Nico and Roman, and that's that. <laughs> what? Terrorists! There's been a big scare, and you can't go across the bridges so good. Oh, fast that five. That is my cab depot, cousin. It is where I make all the money. He cooked yeah, the pizza. pizza. I would stay in Broker. Fucking stay in Hove Beach. Everyone like us does. All right. It's going to take me a little bit of getting used to the driving in GTA 4. Sorry, Roman, you're going to have to save that big titty lecture for later. This is the mansion? <laughs> Just a temporary place. The mansion is coming, cousin. That's the dream. Follow me. This is some mansion, Roman. It looks like good old downtown Detroit. This is where we l get totally punked by Roman. Come in! Make yourself at home. What's mine is yours. Wow. Thanks. Look at that, got him. Look at that mattress. <laughs> if he paid some rent, I wouldn't care. Oh, shit. Oh, that's not nice. Oh, cousin. It's so good to see you. <laughs> Alright, let's beat the shit out of him, Nico. 
I need to change anyway? <laughs> what, did you shit your pants? Oh, you so, God, man. So. Roman, you're a fucking so, pig. So, you full of crap or what? What? Uh, where's luxury condo? Where's sports car? Where's Barbara with big titties and Stephanie who sucks like a vacuum? What are you talking about? In your letters to my mother. In your letters to me. Are you well, telling me I Roman sent your mother letters about Roman, women who give amazing blowjobs? I'm going to start sending my aunt condos, shit like that. Women, money, the beach, Sex report cards for my family. I come here and the only thing big about your life is the cockroaches. <laughs> That's right. I got the base cockroaches, I got the base dirt. There is still a you, dead you cockroach on his shoe. I'm an idiot, but you must admit, I have the best line in bullshit you ever heard. Yeah, this I know, asshole. But here. All I needed was one good guy. One good guy I could do well. Not take over the world, but do okay. Now maybe I have this. But what about you? What about you, cousin? What? What about me? Well, why you live home after all this time? First I hear you are running with the wrong kind. Then I hear you join the merchant navy. Now you're here. You never tell me anything. <laughs> no. What do you mean, no? No, I never tell you anything. Another time. Ooh, mystery man, strange and exotic sailor. What happened? Did your captain make you pregnant? <laughs> Screw you! <laughs> no, no, it's nothing like that. The ships were fine. You know that I lay eggs, Roman. Two things. You remember, during the war, we did some bad things. And bad things happened to us. <laughs> war is where the young and stupid are tricked by the old and bitter into killing each other. I was very young. I'm very angry. Maybe that is no excuse. Roman? Roman! Are you sleeping, you fat no, fuck? No what, are you narcoleptic? That was only like three sentences. It's on the shift. Are you shitting me? Thanks for puking your rat shit coffee all over me. Lots of titties, incredible motors. Lots of titties, incredible motors. Come to Roman's car place today. Yes, Vlad. Sorry. But forgive me, okay? No, no, please don't cut my cock off. Eh? Okay, hmm. Vlad. Yes. A guy named Vlad. He's talking about cutting cocks off. He's probably a good guy. He's probably definitely not going to be a villain that we encounter. The flashing house icon on the radar shows the entrance to this apartment. You can save the game here. Okay. Thank you for that. Sleeping on the bed will save the game in advance time by six hours. I can sleep on that really uncomfortable looking bed next to the picture of some strange lady and a poster of a mostly naked lady. The flashing R on the radar shows where to meet Roman. Okay, cool. Alright, thanks game. Thanks for the rundown. Uh, the autosave slot contains some blah 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 blah. Don't want to override it with current... Uh, no. Are you sure? Autosave will be turned off. Uh, I don't really want to turn autosave off. But whatever. We'll, we'll, we'll turn it off for now. And then I'll just remember to save. Can I save on the go by chance? Also, there's some shit that I... Okay, never mind. I was going to say there's some settings I need to fuck with. But it looks like I already did. So that's good. Alright. Uh, autosave is off. So yeah, I'm going to have to remember to manually save. So... Do not let me forget to manually save, even though you cannot directly communicate with me. Any comments you post to try to be helpful will will be too late, sadly, but I appreciate the, the thought. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and save right now. Why the fuck not? Get into the habit. Start off strong. Let's do it. It'll be good to kind of have like a base file to go off anyway. Alright, save file one. Here we go, baby. I should have switched profiles for this. That would have made this a lot easier. Then I wouldn't have had to juggle with not having autosave. That's some poop, but... 
I think the game lets you save between missions anyway, so we should be fine. You can save any vehicle in the parking spot outside your safe house. Park there, park your car there, and exit, blah, blah, blah. Cool. Eat hot dogs to get your health back. Indeed. That is how that works. Circle around the radar represents blah, 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 all that sort of shit. All right, cool. All right, now the world of Liberty City is our oyster. Um, I'm going to eventually get into the habit of taking taxis between missions because it's going to be really fast, and I like that. But I don't think you're allowed to take cabs this early in the game uh, because it wasn't even letting me hail that one. So normally you can hail a cab and then you can get in the back seat and kind of use that to fast travel, which is it's probably going to piss people off. But yeah, I don't think it's going to let me get in this cab. Yep, I can take the cab, but I can't take the cab, if that makes sense. All right, cool. So we need to go down the street and meet up with Roman. Also, the game is trying to get me to dive out of the car. You know what? I might just do that game. Oh, coming through. Sorry, I'm getting used to these brand new driving physics. I'm not used to them. Sorry. Whoever came up with... Oh my god, there's a cop right there. I'm sorry, officer. Oh my god. Yeah, there was no getting out of that. I just murdered like 10 people in front of that guy. Guys, I'm sorry. Coming through. Call me Mr. Sidewalk. It's okay. It's just a one-star wanted level. Nothing nothing to cry, cry about. Excuse me. Pardon me. God damn. Sorry, guys. I'm new here. I'm new... I'm new in this country. I don't know the rules of the road, for fuck's sake. Give me a damn break here. This place is a joke. You're telling me this isn't how we drive in America? This is how we drive in whatever the fuck country I'm from. Vandoscavia? I'll tell you what, guys. These roads are nothing like those Vandoscavian roads, but I can get, I can get used to this. So usually what we do in Vandoscavia is... We, uh, we find this hot dog guy, and then we just sort of reverse... Oh, come on, that's not what I want to do. Uh, I just want to kind of slowly ragdoll... Yeah, there we go. Alright, just, 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 just... Yeah! I wanted you to feed my car a hot dog. Nothing, you can't get nothing to go my way here. Alright. So we're at, we're at full health. All we can really do at this point is go work for Roman. Which, that would have, you know, been pretty lickety split, but... I had to go and piss off the cops by driving the only way I know how. Like I said, I'm not from this country. And Roman's just like, oh, cousin, drive everywhere. Fuck you, stupid idiot. Come on, big guy, I do some work or get out of here. We don't need jokers. Screw you. Screw you. Baby, when I look into your eyes, it means something. I see little Romans, I see little Mallories, I see stars, I see angels. In my homeland, we have a saying. Yeah, we got one too. You're a fag. <laughs> <laughs> oh, roasted. Fucking idiot. How can I take you seriously? Very difficult, I think. Hello, Roman. Hello, this. <laughs> Mallory, this is my cousin I tell you about, Nico. Hi. Nico, this is Mallory, the beautiful girl I tell you about. See? Not everything I tell you is bullshit. I bet most of it was. Hey. I hope you're less full of shit than your cousin over here. <laughs> Thank you. This is the woman that I'm going to marry. <laughs> Whatever you say. I thought you were going to marry me, hey, baby. Brad. Hey, Bud. <laughs> Great. <laughs> You're fucking crazy, man! <laughs> <You're so laughs> what the fuck, fun. Roman? Otherwise, this beautiful lady is good. I know. I'm a fat prick. What did I do? <laughs> <laughs> what the? Well, do, man. Who spoke of this? No. Jesus Christ. <laughs> you struck. Then you say your phone out of batteries. You treat me like a bitch. Never. I didn't treat you like an idiot, not a bitch, huh? <laughs> I guess it's true. The beautiful woman do like the guys with a funny sense of mm -hmm. humor. Ho oh, ho, I'm laughing. <laughs> I'll get you the money. I know. And Roman, tell this fucking yokel here, if he doesn't stop staring at me, I'll have his head chopped off and put a film of it on the internet! Hey man, good luck with that. The guy who runs Best Gore doesn't run that website anymore. Oh good. Great. You're gonna have to find some other deep yeah. web craziness Fantastic. to upload my beheading. <laughs> Look, say what you like, but at least that guy knows how to speak to a lady. What? Yes, he's all charm. Come on, Nico. Let's yeah, I'm kind of with Roman on that. I'll see you later. He's I'm charming. My cousin around some more. Get him settled. 
He knows how to talk to a lady, all right. All you have to do is be a weird, bald Russian perv, and then I guess ladies love you. All right. We're going to somewhere on Dillon Street. Hardware store. You got it, cousin. Okay, cousin, tell me about this city. And also, I believe, yeah, I'm definitely going the wrong way. We do not want to go that way. You're going to build this oh, shit. Excuse me, everybody. Oh, New to this country. We're going to get money. Beep, 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 beep. Man, New here. You need money to do anything. You're taking me to a backroom game where I'll win all the dollars we need to really see this town. Nightclubs, women, titties. You play, right? <laughs> I am the best. I kick all the asses that play me. They call me the janitor. Because you can't pay your debts and they make you mop the floor? Never of what no. Funny. No, I'm the janitor because I always clean up. I always win. Get it? Excuse me. I seriously hope your cards are better than your nicknames. Nico, wait for me here while I go inside to clean up. You better clean up, you Shit, son of a bitch. I almost forgot. I'm giving you my old phone. My new number's in there. Cool. Call me if some Albanian show up in some shitty beige willard. Those are the guys I owe money to. Do, do not hurt them. I know what you're like, Nico Bellic. You and your debts, Roman. Uve kisto, Nika Drugacie. Alright, we're looking for loan sharks in a shitty beige car. Also, I, I kind of I'm having OCD right now about my parking. Alright. Right here. Alright, remain stationary and look out for the loan sharks. Cool. All we have to do is hang out and wait and look around. And we have a phone now, so we can call Roman. We do all this shit. Yep, you thought GTA 5 was the only GTA game that had a phone? You're wrong. You get a crazy little flip phone in this game. Oh, what the fuck? I accidentally just hung up on Roman. Or I didn't hang up. I, I declined his call. Call me back, Roman. Yeah. It's all quiet out here, Roman. You winning? Don't worry. I'm getting so many bullets. It's like I'm an AK. Miss McCool. All right. Sounds good to me, Roman. I'm just hanging out out here, waiting for these guys to inevitably show up to beat the shit out of you. Because we all know that's exactly what's going to happen. He said they'd be in a beige, like, shitbox. I don't see a beige shitbox yet. Is that a beige shitbox? No. Roman, it oh, wait, yeah, it like is. Your money lending friends are here. Come on, that piece of shit is gambling our money. Right, I should probably call Roman. Oh, what the fuck? Roman! I'm calling you. You gotta get the fuck out of there, son. Cousin, two guys are going in the store. I think they are the loan sharks you speak of. Shit, I'm down. You better get out of there. All right, all right, I'm coming. Man, he like barely got out of there. Shit, Nico, it's them. They must have been told I was here. Oh shit! Cheese it! Please don't hurt the men after us, cousin. Cheese it! Enough as it is. Oh, I won't hurt him, Roman. But I can't stop them from hurting my- hurting themselves trying to keep up with my sick- Why is there an- Why- What is this ambulance doing? I swear it's- he, This guy's just doing laps around this area. He's probably making work for himself, hitting people. Oh, excuse me, excuse me, Wow, we lost those guys immediately. They didn't even have a chance to, like, shoot at us or anything. Fuck those Shylocks, they'll get their money. They just have to wait. We should stand up to them. Gidetti e bonus. Nico, you're new. You don't understand the way things work. Oh, yeah? We are at the point. What the America. fuck? Oh, dude. If I had a gun, I would fucking put you in your place, you sub bitch taxi. Be careful of them. All right. We're here. Oh, you like your phone? Maybe one day you get a premium quality one like mine. Then you will have really made it. I can only wish. See you later, Soon guys. you will get iPhone 6 Plus, Nico. Then you will have really made it. Alright. Well, there goes that mission. Hey, I got 30 bucks. So we have a whopping total of 35 bucks. And hey, there's a Corvette right here. Give me that Corvette. Give me that Corvette. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. It's my... No, Nico, what are you doing? Get in the Corvette. Fucking... We're jacking this dude with the weird-looking hair. Yeah. 
Out of the car. You don't know how to drive this thing. Oh, no. I don't think so, buddy. <laughs> Sorry. All right. So now I think we need to wait for Roman to give us a call. And then we can go to another mission. And um, I think something else happens. I can't quite remember. But, okay. There's the R. So Roman may or may not call us. I don't really know. Let's just go ahead and make our way back there. I can't remember which... Uh, at which point we unlock the ability to take taxis. But that's going to be pretty sweet. We got a text from Roman. Uh, Shit, need help. Come to the deco. De Why did I say deco? <laughs> yeah, come to the deco quick, man. Rom. Alright, Roman, I'm, I'm literally at the depot. Excuse me, lady. <laughs> Give you a little love tap before I jump into the mission. Come on, Daddy, what's your problem? 